What's going on guys? Today we're testing the new Glazer rubbers from Butterfly. Now the Glazer comes in two versions, the Glazer and Glazer 09C. Now the price point of this rubber is where it gets interesting as it's close to half the price of the Dignic series. Yet Butterfly claim Glazer uses the same top sheet technology as the Dignic series and also shares the Spring Sponge X, however with a softer sponge. Glazer has a 38 degree sponge hardness, whereas the Glazer 09C has a 42 degree sponge hardness. So throughout the review, we tested both these rubbers on a T-Mobile ALC and also saw how they stacked up against the Dignix 09C. Right then, let's get into it. So first off, we both tried the Glazer 09C and we could feel it has that same grippy tacky feel that you get with the Dignix 09C. The shots are very stable with a lot of accuracy. Now the feeling during the contact is similar, however the speed is quite a bit slower. <laughs> Kinda of doesn't matter how I block it, it seems to just go on. Yeah, yeah, it just yeah. seems like it's very like, even though you, I can feel you're getting a lot of spin, it's not very reactive off the bat. Not too spin sensitive. It's not, yeah, spin sensitive. It's not like it, someone spins it and it pings out. I feel yeah. like I can kind of just cushion it well. Yeah, so, so we're finding at times with the Glazer 09C, it felt like we couldn't miss. The amount of grip and spin helps you play with a lot of stability in the rally. <laughs> How many times I'm out of position and I can just still grip it in? Yeah, that's where the, the spin really helps. When you're bat battling out of position, ball's a bit low. You want to just get that one in play. Yeah. That's, that's a good thing about rubber, a good grip, you know. Like, I can't normally, like... Sling it. Yeah, like this. Maybe because it's slower, you can just feel free. I think so. See, that's the grip, it kept you in point. Stefan Quay shot, yeah. yeah. The grip kept me in. It's the chairman in me. It's not ultra slow, definitely not. No. But like, it, you will definitely feel a big difference from something like this to 10 g 5 for example. For sure, for sure. Like, it's a lot difference. more lively, a 10 g 5 yeah. Yeah, so when using a Tenny G05 or Dignix 09C type of rubber, you're going to be able to hit winning shots easier. Now the Glazer 09C is much more sided towards control, so it's actually quite hard to win outright points, even when in good position to do so. Where this rubber excels is with blocking, countering, and controlling the table. Uh, 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 oh! <laughs> okay, so moving on to the regular Glazer. Now even though it's softer than the Glazer 09C, it's still a pretty hard rubber, but has a totally different feeling. For me the Glazer feels more lively, almost like a tamer version of Dignix 05, and you're going to find it much easier to hit through your opponent with when compared to the Glazer 09C. The Glazer. Okay, so I am now going to compare the Glazer 09C with the normal Glazer. So first off, the Glazer 09C. Okay, and now the Glazer. Yeah, I can definitely feel there's a lot more speed in the normal Glazer, the red one there. I mean, you do lose a little bit of the grip, I feel, but the speed is a lot more similar to, you know, more European style rubber. Yeah. It's very much different feeling. It's still got a very good grip, don't get me wrong, but not on the level of, you know, the 09C. Yeah. 
All right then guys, so I'm sure you all want to know how the Glazer 09C compares to Dignick's 09C. Well, in a nutshell, it's similar in how it feels on contact with the ball, but it does come off noticeably slower. Because the Glazer 09C is slightly softer, it actually felt easier to produce spin. So for me, at my level, I prefer the Dignick's 09C as I get more venom in my shots. And to be honest, for my game, the Glazer 09C is just too slow. What the Glazer 09C does give you, however, is more control, stability and ease of use due to the softer sponge. Now, where both versions of the Glazer shine is in the service and receive game. They're fantastic in this department. You get bundles of control, good grip and again, high ease of use. Now the reason for this is because they're not so reactive to incoming spin, unlike something like the Tenor G05 where you have to be precise with incoming spin. Now talking of all this control, we had a lot of fun rallies. Check this out. So there we go guys, there was the Glazer series. Now an interesting release from Butterfly because of course over the last few years, they've been releasing rubbers a lot more suited to advanced level players, such as the Dignix series, the Dignix 09C. But this Glazer series, because it is quite a bit slower than those rubbers, but still possesses the spin and grip, it really will help developing players. For me personally, it's too slow because I need something that gives a bit more speed when I'm playing the top end shots. But for developing players, it can be suited very well. And the reason for that is because I think a lot of developing players, they get rubbers that are too quick for them. So what happens is they tend to play shots and they're conservative because they don't have the confidence. When you sink a bit slower, it means you need to play full length shots so it can help you develop your technique. And that's what the Glazer series will help with as it does have that grip and tackiness too. So guys, let's see how the Glazer series stacks up in the T2D rubber ratings. So first off, both these rubbers, as mentioned throughout, have great grip, which helps hold the ball well in the rally, with the 09C having a bit more. Now the Glazer 09C is slower than the regular Glazer, and both are slower than the Dignix and Tenergy series. As you can see across the board, the Glazer 09C has high ratings, apart from the top end speed and smashing. Now when it comes to the regular Glazer, it's essentially a softer, tamer version of the Dignix 05, and for me, a big upgrade from the Resina, which was Butterfly's previous main rubber for players that don't want high end speed and value control more. So there we go guys, the new Glazer and Glazer 09C had a lot of fun reviewing this rubber. We've had a lot of requests for it and yeah, me and Tom had lots of fun rallies, very consistent and a new budget friendly series from Butterfly, very well suited for intermediate players. So guys, let us know in the comments below what you think of the new Glazer series. Have you tried it yet or are you gonna try it? For now guys, be sure to like, subscribe for plenty more reviews. Thanks for watching.